Hey everyone, what's up? It's Silent Phil. So, you know, I've been playing God of War for a while, and looking back at the videos that I've uploaded and even editing the newest ones, I pretty much am just getting bored myself watching it. I am really getting nowhere fast. Uh, you know, with it being a blind playthrough and not knowing where to go, what to do, and where things are at. And you know, me, I am a completionist through and through. I like to complete games 100%, and I'm sure there's a time in the game where you can actually backtrack and go to places you've visited before. In fact, I think that's kind of how they set it up, because I know there's certain temples or tombs or whatever, you know, you couldn't unlock because you needed a certain key, which I don't have. But I've also realized that there's a lot of collectible items that I've missed, and I just kind of hate seeing that, and also just going blindly and then reaching a dead end, and like, okay, maybe there's nothing I can do here, and then realizing, no, there isn't anything I could do there, so I wasted all that time and recording doing that. So what I'm going to do, now hear me out here, is going to restart God of War, but instead of being a blind uh, playthrough, it's going to be uh, a guided walkthrough, okay? I also have another guided walkthrough kind of in the works, but it's the very beginning of the works, but I'm not going to really get into that until uh, I really finish God of War or Far Cry New Daughter. Yeah, it was just hell on wheels for me personally um so i apologize but yeah it's gonna start over again so this is gonna be the first episode of the guided walkthrough and i hope you all enjoy please you know keep the comments coming likes whatever let me know you know me love you all peace out well not really peace out because it's just it's gonna be the intro of it but anyway <laughs> sorry i don't even know where i'm going with this but yes this is gonna be guided walkthrough of god of war now so here we go. All right, everyone, so here we are again with God of War. Um, you know, usually I'd hit continue, but considering what I'm doing now, I'm going to do new game. Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, balance experience, story. Uh, you know, it was really challenging. I don't want to... Uh, gameplay challenge. See, I kind of... You know what? Balance experience. I'll just keep with that. So, yep, there you go with the seamless interaction. So, yeah, press R1 to swing the fine thin axe. That's all you have to do here at the beginning. I won't prompt it the second time, but just keep doing it. Some. 
get in the boat, boy. Alright, so simple controls at the beginning. Use the left stick to move. We're just walking forward over to the boat as well. With At Atreus. Still want me to tie to the boat? Now here, I know it just shows a circle, but it really means just pressing the circle button on the remote. So this starts our first main quest, or really the main main quest, I guess, called the Mark Trees, or the journey, you know, the Mark Trees. So now we just have to go our way through. Did something change? The forest feels different. Everything is different, boy. Try not to dwell on it. Yes, sir. Just a quick little uh, boat ride to the other side here where the dock is. Press the circle button again to uh, dock at the dock. <laughs> Oh, Kratos, you so strong. <laughs> uh, to be able to carry something like that that easily. Sheepers. But, again, just follow uh, your son, Atre uh, Atreus, 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 up the path until the next scene automatically plays. It'll seamlessly go into the scene. That's kind of how this game works. And, of course, just looking at all the different... Credits roll by as you walk along. Back to your house. That was the last. She's ready. Find 
your way home. You are free. Sorry. Squeeze. This knife. It was hers. Now it is yours. She thought you'd hunt. She knew. Shall we? Now? Now. What are we hunting? You are hunting deer. Which way? In the direction of deer. Okay. Uh... This way. <laughs> Alright, and so it begins. So, uh... Updated, uh... The Mark Trees is Hunt with Atreus. Father? Why are we doing this now? I need to know you can survive the journey. Then we leave for the mountain? Depends on you. Hunt. Okay. Now, the reason why I'm kind of staying back here is because this game has a lot of collectibles in it. Uh, when I was doing the blind Let's Play of it, I was missing quite a few of them. So the first, though, before you go through this gate, make a right, and you'll see this shining uh, item on the ground. Go to it, press circle to pick it up, and you will get Artifact 1 of 4 for the Lost Toys of Lost and Found. Now, if you want to see it, hold up on the D-pad, and I'll tell you about it and show you, you know, what you have and... If you get all the collectibles, you'll see the reward would be 350 experience points. Of course, this is like a RPG, so you'll be able to upgrade Kratos and Atreus, the weapons, and all that different stuff. So, um, yeah, just keep an uh, eye out for things as you move through the game, and I, yeah, um, have fun. Yeah, this way. What did you find? Tracks. Not deer, though. I'll keep looking. Okay, so you can use this to look around. He thought he found uh, tracks, but not deer. So what you want to do is go to this next one. We're going to be picking up some hack silver, which is a uh, going to be the currency used in this game. And then we're going to keep on heading up north, and then we'll spot this next part right here to the left, which is the second toy for the Lost and Found, which should be like a ship, I believe. There we go, lost and found. Uh, and before going up the steps, you want to go down and around and you'll find a chest underneath here, which just press circle to get some splinters and to get more hack silver. Um, now, after you collect that, you can go ahead and go back around and up go ahead. up the bridge. More tracks? Yeah, but they're too round. Could be a wild boar. Good. Oh, now what? <laughs> 